today we are doing a full flush and pressure wash of our black tank. It's one of those things that I read about and researched so much and how to keep a black tank clean and keep it from smelling because I have super, super sensitive sense of smell and so does our youngest daughter. I smell like every little odor and so I want it cleaned out as best as possible um, and I keep reading about how to keep the right chemicals in it to keep it broken down and blah blah blah. Anyway, today Nick is making me happy by assisting me in completely flushing it and cleaning it out for us. The first step of the process is just to empty the black tank like you normally would and then we will hook up a special attachment to a hose and go inside and actually stick that down inside the toilet. Let's get started. This is actually the first time I've ever emptied the black tank. I always make Nick do it. I just pull on this. The second step of the process is getting all the hoses connected and then run through a window in your RV so that you can run them into your bathroom and then connecting up the swivel stick at the end. This is actually what goes inside the toilet and this piece at the bottom swivels around and sprays everything that's in your black tank. Since we're not gonna stick the camera down the toilet to show you how it works inside the black tank, this is a little bit of a demonstration of how the nozzle on the end of this actually works. So we've got the hose in through the window into the bathroom and I've covered up our shower items with the shower curtain just in case there's some terrible catastrophe. Um, but the stick is on the hose and this will control the water pressure. It'll turn it on and off and control the pressure of the spray down in there. The next thing we have to do is stick it down the toilet and start spraying out the crap. You want to make sure you start with it touching the bottom and then you need to move it around a little bit to make sure it's getting all the sides and all around everywhere. It's kind of scary as it swishes around but hopefully it's doing its job. So the little spinner spins around at the bottom of the hose but you still have to move the hose around, around to, make, to make sure you get all the angles. I don't know what's going on down there, it's making a lot of noises. Are you helping to drain out the poop tank? Mm hmm Should we throw you in? No. <laughs> now that we sprayed everything out inside the black tank, we're actually going to close this up again so that we can fill it up and then drain out anything that might have broken loose. We've done a couple rounds of spray and then fill the tank and empty it out to really get everything out of there. The final step that we're doing is we're using a black tank cleaner. This is RV Digest It. And we've got about a gallon of water in there and then we're gonna put half a cup of this into the tank. And we're gonna try not to use our tank for about 24 hours so it can really just, it's enzymes that eat up and break everything down to make sure everything is completely out. The process was actually easier than we expected, pretty simple. It should take about 20 minutes, more or less, depending on how many times you fill up the tank and drain it out. We'll have full detailed step-by-step -step instructions below in the description, and we'll also link to all the products that we used in the process. So if you have any questions, be sure to comment and subscribe to see more videos in the future.